do. It's a 3-1 defeat today. Um, in the game we were large, largely on top on, I think. Even if we snatch a draw at the end, it would seem like we've been hard done by them. Um, what, what went wrong out there today? I don't think anything went wrong. I think uh, there's such small margins in such a tight division uh, in the quality stakes. I think, you know, we should go one up. The Linos give offside to Taron twice. I want to watch it back to see whether they are because they're tight decisions. Uh, and that would put us 1-0 up. And they're the things in, in this league, sometimes you need to get your nose in front for the game to open up. But look, I thought the lads, once again, they give everything. They kept going to the end. Uh, the fans backed us all the way. We just got to stick together. We are in a little sticky patch in the sense of results not going our way. Decisions not going our way, but we can't make any excuses. The minute you start making excuses and trying to blame, and you get that blame culture within the group and within the club, it will all go poisonous and it just won't work. So we won't have it, we won't stand for it. We just got to make sure we all stick together now, keep sticking to our beliefs. There's nothing wrong on the football pitch at the minute other than the results. And I know it is a results business, but us as a management team, we've got to make sure we keep sticking to our beliefs like we did when we did last season. We went through a few sticky patches and we kept sticking to it and we'll come out the other side. We believe in this group of lads and they'll come out the other side. You know, they'll take their chances and we'll go one and two up and punish teams and kill teams off. Uh, but full credit to Dorkin, they kept going. And for me, it's refereeing decisions once again today that's cost us. The first goal, that the, their attackers left it on Mason in the far corner, uh, which he don't give the foul and they go score. And then for me, it's, it's offside, it's blatantly offside. Uh, the linesman said to me at the end that Munns was playing him on. Look, I don't know 100% from my angle, but I'll be shocked if Munns is playing him on because he looked high and he looked blatantly offside. And it's, that makes it 2-1. And, that, and goals change games. I say the, the, the timing of them as well. Both both their goals come in when we're enjoying large spells of, of territory and chances in games. Um, how come we just can't get that ball in there at the moment when we're on top? No, of course. Look, it's it's a big plus today. Taron scored, uh, which he needed a goal. He really did. There's a few of our lads that need goals from them areas, the wide areas. Dom does. He needs a goal to get himself up and running. I believe once Dom gets his goal and gets up and running, uh, I think he'll start scoring goals for us. It's that confidence. You need to you need to earn that confidence by scoring goals and, and making things happen. But look, Micah come in today. I thought Micah was excellent. It's a really good debut. He probably hasn't kicked a ball properly for the last month or so, so it's going to take time to get him up to speed. I thought Sam, Sam Matthews come on, he hit the post and showed his quality. Uh, he, hasn't, he hasn't kicked a ball properly since pre-season. We've got to manage his minutes and get him up to speed. Uh, so look, We've got players that we're coming in, we know what we've got in the building, we've got to keep sticking to our beliefs and keep believing in what we do, and that's what we do, we keep installing belief in the lads, and look, we really appreciate the fans, once again, clapping the lads off, it means so much to them, and we've just got to make sure now we go into Notts County, uh, pick ourselves up, and it's another game in quick succession, sometimes you can look at it and think that it's, it's a negative, but we look at it as a plus, uh, so look, it's, it's good, Gio today, he's pulled up the cramp, because he's given everything. And that's all we can ask from the lads. When they give everything and stick to our beliefs in what we do, the results will come.